Receive the royal decree. The Wu brothers, for their courage, deserve it for the defense of our border. And His Majesty's realm shall return to the palace immediately. Tremble and obey. Yes, yes sire. sire. My congratulations to the both of you. Your father is expecting you to return to the palace. So you must leave with me immediately. Please. General Van, don't hide the truth from me. I know that my whole family was killed. Uh, I have really no idea of what you are talking about. Defense of our border is more important to the palace. May I ask you, are you refusing to come? Uh, General Yan, why don't I accompany you? And my brother can stay here, and then we... I cannot accept this. You shall both follow me. Uh, uh, These are my orders. Guard! Yes! <laughs> I said that we go with you. But I want you both. I won't go. Poster. Who dies so is wanted by the court. Whoever wants to What do you do? Whoa, yeah. whoa, 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 aside. Oh, come on. Hey, hey you. you. Where are you going? Well, That's right. Whoa. Uh, hey, hey. What's in there? Oh, uh, my wife's pregnant. <laughs> oh. <laughs> hey, don't touch my hey. wife. Oh. <laughs> Please leave her alone. <laughs> Please forgive my rudeness just a moment ago. I think you must be mistaken. My name is not Wu. Uh -huh. Master Wu, there's no need to be afraid. I was once Chi Wei's student, uh, Dung Gao. So you are the renowned Dung Gao. Nice to meet you. Oh, <laughs> you are too polite. Uh, Master Wu, please sit. Thank you. This house is a very safe place. You may relax here. There's no need to be afraid of anything here. You'll come to no harm. Master Dung, I don't care about my life. I only want to get my revenge. If I could only get to the Wu State. And ask them to give me an army to fight them. I know that that is what worries you, and I will help as best as I can. Zhu Wang is now heavily guarded with soldiers loyal to the king. Your picture is everywhere with a reward for Master Wu. Ask yourself, how could you pass through safely? But... If you wish to leave here, you must use some tricks and be very clever. Oh, 
I have a friend who might help you. He's called Hua Rang Na. He's uh, just about your height and build. If we could change the way you look and the color of your skin, you may have a chance to pass safely. Oh, Master Wu, would you like to give it a go? <sighs> it is my only option. Can you please tell me, where can I find this man? Oh, he should come to see me. I expect him to be here in one or two days from now. Uh, I suggest you stay here and wait for him to arrive. I will do just as you say. Master Dong? Any news of our friend? Uh, not as yet, but he's on his way. <laughs> Another day wasted. I've been here for five days now. Maybe Hua Fu Na will not come. Maybe this is a trap. It can't be. He could have reported to the cop. But why haven't they come yet? No. If I die, who will take revenge for my family? Revenge? No! Master Wu? Master Wu? Master Wu, my friend has come. Look here, this is Master Wu of the great Wu family. Master Wu? Uh-huh. Master Wu, what happened to your hair? What's wrong with it? What's wrong with my hair? Master, look here. See for yourself. Huh? <sighs> Nothing achieved yet. And my hair turns gray. This must be God's will. Dad. Mom. How am I ever going to be able to take revenge for you now? Master, I think it's a good sign. Uh, what's the point in getting upset about it? It's only hair. Grey hair means death. Are you saying to me, it's a good sign? Uh, of course. You don't look the same now. If you just add a little disguise, I can guarantee you that uh, nobody will know that you are Master Wu, after all. Hey, you, take off your hat. Is this a regulation? I want to chop it off if you don't do it. Come on. Hey, hey, hey. <laughs> hey, my friend, take off your hat as he instructed. It's all right. You have no reason to hide from these gentlemen here. If you don't take it off, I'll have you arrested. I'm Huang Fu Na. I can't give a damn what you say. I believe you are Wu Wan. Take it off. Just look at him. Then take him away! You're mistaken. He's not Wu. He's my master, Huan Pu Na. Then you are Wu Huan. Uh, sorry, do I look like him? Of course you don't. You don't look anything at all like him. Now take him away! Go! Go on, move! Oh, what are you looking at? Move it! Come on! Go about your business! Move it! Come on! General, I found a man who looks like Wu Na. Move it! Come on! Move! Hmm. What 
are you looking at? Move! Yes, yeah, sir. Move it, yes, sir. Move it! Move! 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 Come on, Lois! Move it! Come on! Out of the way! Oh! Come on! Oh, yeah! God! Oh! Quick! Quick! Your Excellency. Whose idea was this? Uh, these people are peasants. They've got nothing to do. Uh, we're going to use them to uh, help rebuild the palace. We've been fighting the Jews for many years now. And don't you think it's a waste of money rebuilding the palace and a waste of manpower? What do you suggest then? Right. I will go to my father and discuss it with him, and see if I can change his mind and cancel a new palace. So he wants to rebel against the Duke, huh? Well, let's see the Duke before he does. Come on. Your Highness, as you are well aware, we have been fighting the Chews for many years. Now, the state is now weak. The people are tired. It should be a time to conserve our resources, to spend all our money on the new palace seems wrong to me. The people have suffered many hardships these past years. They are now poor. I believe the people will complain and criticize. More importantly, they are our main resource. Your Royal Highness, his words are nothing but nonsense. It's obvious he's planning a rebellion. Your Royal Highness, I am only loyal to you. My hope is to unite the whole country so we can be one. Rebellion is not my aim. God knows me well enough. My words are true. Mm -hmm. So what are you suggesting? Give up the building of the new palace. Reduce taxes and a ceasefire. Give our people a well-earned rest to regain their strength. Mm -hmm. State is my concern. It's not yours. You don't look very well. Go home and rest a while. I'll summon you. Sire. Leave me alone now. Yes, sire. <laughs> that man is irritating me now. Why don't we get rid of him? As you suggested earlier. We have one problem. He is well liked. It could be difficult. Uh, we could do it secretly. No one would know. Right. Then I'll leave it to you. Sire. Now let me tell you a secret nobody knows. Chu Wang has no morality. <laughs> and a father dares to take a son's wife. And a virtuous official, Wu Tai Shu, his whole family was murdered. Wu Tai Shu, then a miracle one night, his hair turned gray and nobody saw him and he passed through safely. I tell you, it's true. It's oh, oh, his hair turned gray. He passed through safely. Spare a little money, lady. A little money. Some money, please. Oh, what do you think you're doing? Stay away from me. Oh. <laughs> oh, please, old woman, take pity on me. Give me some money, will you? Go away! Let me tell you one more story. Zhuang Zhu is a great man. He's a good and just man. He cares for the poor, not for the rich. He's a hero. Oh, you horrible creature, get out of here. You'll only bring us bad luck. Go on, go on. Uh, uh, dear lady, uh, don't be angry. Uh, you're really very nice to me, you know that. And you're so pretty. <laughs> oh, you get are. out of here, you creature. Get out of here or I'll beat you up. I'll beat you. Oh. Hey. That beggar, he sang a song about Wu Das Yu. Wouldn't it be good? If we could just become good friends. Isn't he in the Wu state? No, the chances are quite good. These men are very important, so look after them properly.
The Yan Yan plays so well. Oh, I know. Yes, I'll drink a toast for him. Yan Yan, you're really something. Here's a toast to you. Here, take it. Come on. 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 I thought you enjoyed music. What's that? I've only come for some fun. Keep out of my business, will ya? Take the money, and then leave here. Money. You can't buy me. The money I make is honest. I'm not a thief. It's not easy to make money, yet you spend so much. I hate them teasing you. Thank you for your help. I'm the criminal Wu Du Chu. Watching you and your hunting party is a sin. Please forgive me. Are you telling the truth? I heard Wu's hair turn gray overnight because he wanted to leave Jiao Guan. So please take off your hat. I'm a criminal. I dare not. You saved my life. I absolve you of your sins for this one deed. Thank you, Lord. You are Wu Yuan. You're known as a wise and brave man. You've been accused wrongly. I know you're innocent. I wish I could have met you a long time ago. 
It must be fate that has brought us together here today. I heard you were going to be hunting here today. I've waited for you until this very day. <laughs> I know you are good at tactics and also swordsmanship as well. It is a common skill. It's nothing. Please forgive my rude behavior. <sighs> it is such a shame that I don't have one man as talented as you are in my army. I need men like you. So are you willing to stay with me and serve me, Lord? I'll have to decline your offer. Chu Wang must die. He's an evil man. He took his daughter-in-law for his own wife. And he killed my whole family but me. I was lucky to escape. But I swore on that day, I will execute him with my own hands and take revenge for my family. How will you do that? I worked a perfect plan for it. But I'll need someone to uh, recommend me. You want me to recommend you to the Duke, then? I know it's rude of me, but it's my only way. But I'm willing to die if I can meet with you. All right. You may stay with me, and I'll take you to the court first thing tomorrow morning. Thank you so much for your kindness. <laughs> You fought well today, my lord. I am not your match. Your swordsmanship is the best in the world. <laughs> Has someone come to kill Kwang yet? There's no report yet, sir. But I'm sure there will be. Hmm. <laughs> I don't think so. Uh, then why not? Sir, sir! Oh, sir. the man sent to assassinate Kwang. He's still alive, and he's my only threat now. Please, uh, please give, give us, us sir. He must know. He must know I want to get rid of Yung, Yu Jiang. Yeah. Huh? Who is he? Who is he? He is official Wu Wan from Chu State. Allow me to introduce you, Chu Yung, and Gai Yang. It's my pleasure to meet you. I heard that you're a very brave man. I've never had thought you're as old as this. Uh, the older, the braver they are. <laughs> Are you going to recommend him to the Duke in order to use his forces to fight Chu? I would be grateful if you would help persuade him for me. The king is here! Now get up. Thank, Thank you, you, sire. Your Royal Highness. 
The official Wu Wan escaped from the Chu, and now he has a plan to retaliate. Please listen to it. Your Royal Highness, I'm official Wu. Wu Da Xiu. Your Royal Highness, a state should never fight for personal reasons. It's common knowledge. The Wu's were executed for their crimes against the king and state. If we win, he will have vented his anger. If we lose, it's an insult to our state. Please consider this carefully. Master Wu, so you're planning to make this state your home? As for starting a war against the Chu's, we'll discuss that at a later date. Thank you, Highness. What can I do for you, sir? <laughs> Who is that girl playing the music? Oh, <laughs> you mean that girl? <laughs> yeah, she's real pretty, huh? Her name is uh, Yan Yan. Uh, she's the best lute player in the whole state, and a very beautiful girl at that. <laughs> and she's a popular geisha. I don't want to know. Go and give this to her. And ask her to stop playing right away. Huh? Do it now. Uh, don't you know? You've never heard about him? Uh, he's a great hero. He, he'll kill you if you upset him. Kill if you upset him? Don't you believe I wouldn't do the same? <laughs> Tell her to stop playing right this minute. Otherwise, I'll kill the both of them. Uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. The man over there asks Yan Yan to, uh, stop playing the lute. <laughs> Sorry, sir. <laughs> That's what he wants. <laughs> Is it true that your name is Wan Chu? So what if it is? You're gonna leave so soon? You want me to buy you a new flute? A flute doesn't cost much money. I want to have a little talk with you. Oh. Go ahead. You use your sword with that reason, don't forget. I am a swordsman. Before your opponent uses his sword, you shouldn't touch any part of him, except his head. Otherwise, you might miss his head and therefore lose your own head. You know exactly what I mean, don't you? <laughs> a good lesson for me. But then, you're not a swordsman. So you think. I'm not a swordsman. He who carries a sword may also be a thief. <laughs> Can you use a sword? A good question. So then, why don't you try me?
attacking you, but then you are the best swordsman in the land, aren't you now? Right. I have lost today. I'll never fight again. Yesterday morning, His Majesty postponed accepting your plan to attack the Chews. What are we going to do now? Wu has fought against Chu many times before. There was never a winner. Under the present conditions, I think you'd better stay here. Wu Wang is stupid. He's the wrong man. We can't use him. After Chu was overthrown, I'll help you to take revenge. But first, you must help me to get the throne. You are most kind to me. I will owe you a debt all my life. Get up, please. Now, how do we go about all this? The only way is to kill the king. Yes. My thoughts exactly. You are a great swordsman. No, I am not. The assassination of the king will not include me. I can recommend a man who can accomplish this better than I. Who? Wan Ju. Wan Ju? I've heard about him. He's a fine man. But tell me, do you have confidence in him? Hmm. Move with him. Righteous feelings. Use any method to make him grateful to work for us. He has a true love, a well-known geisha. Good. We'll use her to get at him. A good plan. We can use her to get to him. And then our plan will succeed. You will be king. And the treasure will be ours. Take her away! I don't care if your lord wants her. You can't do this. This is kidnapping. It's against the law. You can't do this terrible thing! This is an order from Gai Yu. We must take her back. Move! Ah! Come on! Oh. Leave her alone! Uh. Juan! Who are you? Who am I? Lord Juan. I don't give a damn who you are. You wanna die? I'll ask you the same question. <laughs> <laughs> Oh! 
going on here? Uh, my Lord Guy Yu gave us the order to bring that lady Yan to the palace, but she resisted arrest. Shut up! Uh, oh. I've engaged to be with her tonight. Go back and tell your Lord that Lady Yan was taken by me. Uh. Lady Yan, please. Oh. Another man called Guan Zhu. He escaped too. Oh. Guan Zhu. I don't care who this man is. Go and get it for me now. Yes. You are. I am Wu Dai Su. You are really the famous official from Chu State, Wu Dai Su. Yes, that's me. Sorry for any problems I caused you. Oh, that's all right. I just forgot to say thank you. Don't mention it. We can't stay here. We must leave. Guy Yu's men are searching for us. We should find a place to hide until they've gone. My mother's still at home. I must make arrangements for her. Let's do it to her now. Right. Talk. Where is Guan Yu? I don't know. <laughs> Please believe me, I really don't know. Listen to me now. If you don't tell us where he is right now, <laughs> I'll chop your head off. Kill me if you wish. Oh, <laughs> <laughs> Are you all right? Please forgive me. What trouble are you in, dear? So you bully the weak, huh? Again. Uh, I'll never, never do it again. Uh, spare me. Spare you? Oh, uh, uh, yeah. <laughs> Mother. Wanju. <laughs> Wanju. Let's go. You are a highly respected hero. Make here your home if you wish. Stay as long as you like. 
You'll be treated as part of the family. It is our honor to have you living with us, so please don't feel obligated. I owe you a debt of kindness, and so, from now on, I am your servant. I'm in your debt, sir. Get up, please. Oh, I almost forgot. There's someone who's been waiting for you a long time now. Huh? <laughs> Is it you? It is, my dear. This is my mother. How nice to meet you. Your Highness, Master Wu, I'm confused. <laughs> Ever since she came to the palace, she's carried a knife with her. If I had done anything to harm her, I'm sure she would have killed herself. So there is nothing to worry about. Sorry to offend you. It was not my intention. I carried the knife in case I needed it. To end my own life. A hero and his woman. Let us have their wedding today. Madam, do you agree? We are indebted to you eternally. Whatever you arranged is my approval. Good, then it's settled. Yan Yan, you will leave with Madam right away. We must get ready now. You're going to be a bride very soon. Oh. Yes, sir. Your Highness, I'm nothing but a common man. But a man will die for a friend. I will serve you for the rest of my life. Sir, my friend, if you really mean it, and you'll give me your life, we have a job that depends on you. Are you willing to do it? Just tell me what it is. You had to kill someone. And it's Duralian. Don't worry. If you have any doubts, we won't go through with any of it. No. This is very important. But I'm afraid I can't do it. Your skills are better than mine. Wrong. You are far braver than any of us. Master Wu has a plan. That will be his job. We can all depend on him for that. Does that mean your highness trusts me? Of course. From now on, my destiny is in your hands. If you fail to kill him, I will face the same fate. I will be dead then. I truly appreciate you offering me this opportunity. Don't worry. I shall not disappoint you. Good. You should go and rest now. Right. Please excuse me. What are your feelings about him? Hmm. God has given me one more talented man. I owe you a lot, except my thanks. Oh. Didn't you realize that tonight was a trap to catch you? Even if it's true, I'll honor my Lord. Because he depends on me. I would die for him. And I promised him as much. Whatever you decide, I'll agree to it. So from now on, my life is in his hands. But my heart will be with you. Please don't say that. We may treasure. These memories forever. I want to fill you with the best memories.
Huang has brought himself many geishas. He's been indulging himself in sex games and other vices. He has not been attending to any of his court duties. <laughs> Your Highness. <laughs> Your Highness. His recent behavior has been appalling. He's neglecting his duties at court. I'll handle this matter. You can leave us alone now. Yeah. Your daddy's so brave, you'll be like your daddy when you grow up. I want to learn Kung Fu and be like daddy. I, uh, no. No. Wang. Aye, aye. Don't be like me. Just stick to your books. I will. Yan Yan, promise me, you won't let him. All right. Leave it to me. My love for my family goes deeper than any love. If I stay home longer, I won't be able to leave. His Highness arrives! Your Highness. Your Highness. Uh, your Highness. Has the time come? No. My friend, your wife is scared. Doesn't it bother you? Yeah. Yan Yan, leave us alone a minute. Yes. Excuse me. Highness, is it the right time? Waiting longer can drive me mad. We mustn't act at the wrong moment. It could ruin everything. Are you still practicing daily? Yes, every day. And every possible scenario. I become a master in the art of assassination. Hey, enjoy your family life. I know it's important to you. It hurts me to know that I might lose them. It's in the back of my mind. My friend, I owe you too much already. Highness, hmm. you owe me nothing. But I ask of you one more favor. Please take care of my family. You don't have to worry. We are in the same position. I promise. I will. Treat them as my very own. Thank you, Highness. left the house secretly with the dagger. I was worried. So I came to you. Where's he gone? I don't know. I think I should go to the court right away. You better go and get ready. Cover our tracks. Then return to the court, okay? <laughs> Thank <laughs> you. 
Gentlemen, what a surprise. Fancy finding you awake at this time of the night. Is it against your lord to have a good time? It seems a coincidence that many assassins came to the court tonight, and they were found before they could do any harm to the king. Only two of them escaped, mind you, and we followed them here to your house. <laughs> I understand now. You think I am hiding the assassins? You may have a, a thorough search. His Highness is here! Off dead. Your Royal Highness, I've discovered the assassins. Please take a look. You accuse these two? Yes. Ju Jung, is he your man? Are you mad? No wonder that you failed your job tonight. You are useless. You stupid idiot. You dare to make a fool out of me? Hold it. Listen. Now these two men are my friends and advisors. So please don't get me involved in all this. It would be bad for my image. Well, who is your patron? This is something I would like to keep secret. We could say they're not employed by me. But there is another swordsman who I know his name is Chuan Chu. He's been living in my house lately. Since your country suspects me, inform your king I'll be leaving his state in the near future. Are you planning to leave now? But Chu still wants to have you arrested. Tell me where you will be able to stay. I have somewhere I can go which is safe. Maybe Wa Wang will accept me. It's better than all this suspicion here. Master Wang, I can have Wang represent me. I have to follow the assassins now. You men follow me. Yes, sir. You idiot! You idiot! Yes, sir. Hey, come on, men. Move! Move! Come on. Did you get them? No, no. sir. Hey. There's no way out of here. You better take some men and form a search party. You heard what he said. Get moving! Yes, yes sir! sir. Listen, you are foolhardy. Yang was alert enough to tell me about it. Well, if she hadn't, you'd be dead by now. Highness, there was a man who did try to help me. I didn't know his name. He was killed. Yes, I was. He was one of my men. He'd escaped from Chu State. It was the right thing to do, trying to attack me now. Tonight, they won't suspect me. I was too rash. Hey, don't say that. You nearly gave your life for me. This small injury, it's nothing. Tell me, do you understand why I told you not to act impulsively? The court is so well guarded. All the guards are very skilled. And the king is still alive. But then, even if you had tried to kill him, it wouldn't have helped us at all. Why is that? Because of Gaiyu and Jujan, they control the army. Though the king may die, Quang would not be the successor. Our actions must eliminate all those in our way. But they must be done properly and performed at the right time. 
Do you know exactly what I mean? I shall practice even harder. Encourage my will. Follow your orders. So tell me, did you arrest them? You didn't, so it's lucky I had my guards with me. Otherwise, I could have been killed. Isn't that true? What do you think? Uh, Kwang was injured while trying to protect you, Your Highness, so he was hurt. I remember. You're a good swordsman. And you couldn't beat an assassin. I think, Your Highness, his body has been weakened by excessive sex. Uh, uh, a swordsman, Juan Ju, has been serving him these past few years, and he is very famous. So why... Didn't you tell me all this before? Uh, Your Highness, he is only a common person. His swordsmanship is not that good. Uh, there is talent among the common people, uh, but... All right, then. You'll go to Kwang's place and examine his swordsmanship and take him to the court, if he's really that good. Yes! I welcome you, gentlemen, and escorts. Mm. I heard you can find no opponent in swordplay. The king has sent me here to see if this is true or not. Let's see your swordsmanship. I'm sorry. I'm a mere cavalier. You can't describe me as a swordsman. I'll listen to your teaching. All right. We shall start with the king's bodyguard. Come on! It's over. Quite impressive. I'd like to duel with you myself. Please show some mercy. Don't blame me if anything goes wrong. It'll only be an accident. <laughs> Sanju, thank you for showing mercy. Yes. Thank you for showing mercy to me also. Leave now. Wanju is no good at swordsmanship at all. People often exaggerate these things. You may go now and report this to the king. Yes, we'll leave now. It was with your blessing we attacked the Jeng state successfully. Mm. Good, good. Now you take a good rest. I'll reward you tomorrow morning. Thank you, Your Highness. During our attack on the Jeng State, I found a girl who is very talented in dancing and music. Perhaps you would like her. <laughs> Send her in right away. Your Highness, my name is Gang Si, and I was born in the state. Lift up your head. I want to see your face. I'm guilty. I dare not raise my head. Ah, uh, you're innocent now. Thank you. Hey, <laughs> you people get out of here. Leave yeah, me alone. 
Excellency, I just heard that the Chu King has died. What? The Chu King's dead? Tell me, is it true? Yes, it is. You may go. Yes. Congratulations. The Chu King is dead. Why are you so sad? Your troubles are over. I was to kill him with my own hands to take my revenge. Now, he's dead. And I have failed again. I can't have my revenge. <sighs> Try not to be so sad. It's not good for you. Does his death have anything to do with us then, tell me? The court is empty now. It's our chance. You may suggest Wu Wang. As Chu is in a mess, we could attack Chu and take over. What if he assigns me to attack Chu? What then? Tell me. Stall him. Tell him you're not well yet. Guy Yu and Zhu Yang are the right ones. Get Ching Jai. Allied with Wei. Good idea. Your Excellency, His Highness wants to see you right away. The Chu King is dead. Do you have any suggestions? Well, the Chu state must be in a state of confusion right now. It's a good opportunity to attack them now. Who's to be the general? To attack Chu, the sooner the better, is the only option. I would take the job if I were healthy enough to do so. But my suggestion is, Guy Yu and Zhu Yong would be your best choice. Uh, what about Qing Ji? Qing Ji conquered the Jing and allied with the Wei, then could assemble all the troops and destroy the Chu. That would be easy for them. Good. Zhu Zhong, Guy Yu, take 20,000 men. Attack the Chu from both land and the sea. Yes! yes. <laughs> Your Excellency. Hey, get Your up. Oh, yeah. I know you have a girl who's a very talented musician. Uh, her skill is quite average. She's not material for the court. Uh, uh, this concubine here is also talented. Why don't we let them compete with each other? I have recently employed a new chef whose speciality is cooking fish. He is most skilled. Why don't you come over to my palace to taste our fish and enjoy the charming music one evening, sir? Mm, good. Let's make it the day after tomorrow, shall we? Uh, is that all right for you, my love? Uh -huh. Whatever you say, my king. <laughs> Gentlemen, our destiny will be decided tomorrow. Success or defeat depends on this. The assassination depends on what? But the rest of it all depends on you. You've trained us for so long, and you've shown us much kindness. We'll do our best tomorrow for you, Your Highness. We, we will, will do, do our, our best for you, Your Highness. This, this we, we promise you. sharper sword we could find. Please take it. I 
I will succeed if I use the sword you've given me. Hmm. The best sword for the best swordsman. Tomorrow it's your day. Your Highness has treated us so well for so long. I will succeed. My only worry is my mother and son. That's all right. I have made arrangements. I'll foo Chai to take them out of town. If we fail, Master Wu will take them away to safety. I shall repay your kindness. You may all go and get some rest now and prepare for the challenge that lies ahead. Yes, yes sir! I would like to play with my son for the last time. Please excuse me. Please. Master Wu, do you think we will succeed? If nothing goes wrong, a very good chance. Mother? Mother? What is it? The time. It's come now. Tomorrow. made arrangements for your son and wife. If I fail, Wu and Fu Chai will take you away tomorrow somewhere else. You must go with them. There will be a competition. Yan Yan against the concubine. She must be careful. I can't take care of her, Ma. I cannot... you anymore. Take care of yourself. Look out for bad things. My son, His Highness has been very good to us. You must repay this kindness. I'll take care of myself. Don't. Don't you worry. Oh. Mother. Go and see your son. You won't see him much after tomorrow. to play the lute? Mm. I've not played for a long time. My fingers are stiff. 
please take care of yourself. I must practice the whole night. Don't push me away. Uh, then stay with me. Promise you won't disturb me. You haven't played for a long time. I want us to enjoy ourselves, like before. I know. Tomorrow you kill the king. Yes. It's our only chance. Get everything ready. There's nothing to do. You see, my sword will decide everyone's fate. That moment is everything. What will happen? If you don't succeed. There is nothing His Highness and I can do. Fu Chai and Yi will leave the city. And in case I fail, we will take them away from here. What about Mother? Mother just killed herself. Yao. I'm so sorry. In case I fail, look after yourself. Wife and husband have the same fate. We share whatever problem may occur. Well, if you two are to fight, well, with me, we have a 50% chance to work it out. How to match your step? Loot playing is only the king's excuse. What he wants to find out is what you're thinking. How many people will come with him? To the ceremony tomorrow. He won't bring all the people with him. But there will be more than a hundred of them. He'll bring all his guards with him. It will be very difficult to get anywhere near him. Except the host himself. If he can predict your mind, he can guide your moves, and it'll make it a sure kill. What shall I do? Don't worry. Your wife's skill is outstanding. Don't forget, she's living in luxury. The loot shouldn't go with luxury. It is not the way. The girl, she cannot be my opponent. Just now, I wasn't concentrating because I didn't know your arrangement for tomorrow. But I don't worry about that now. What if the king predicts my mind? What then? Tell him to watch me instead. Tell him, keep watching me and think of nothing else but me and my performance. You can handle it perfectly. I'll try my best. No one can do things 
perfectly in their life. We don't owe anything to His Excellency. But He has been good to us only because He needed you. I understand. If I'd not met him, I'd have lived a happy life. But it gave me a chance to be involved in this. Is there no righteousness in the houses of power? Kuang and Wu, they are only politicians. And we, we are used by them. We live with another gang of people. They used you, and you used them. If only I can achieve it. Even if I die, I hope you will treat my son well. It's fair that we've struck an agreement. If I die, that is. That is true. I agree with you. Let me play the lute again. I can forget everything. When I hear the music, hmm, otherwise, how can I pass such a long night? Don't be so polite, please. His Highness will be here soon. He sent me here to help you both. I have everything well arranged, but thank you very much. I'll follow my orders and search this palace very thoroughly, I tell you. Hmm. Yes. General Al! Yes! Come on! There's nothing to be found. There's nobody around. Report! We searched every corner of the house and gathered all the weapons together. Everything is in order, sir. Hmm. Good. His Highness is here! Long live! Long live! Long live the King! Get up. This is... An unusual gathering of close friends. But my guards were worried that without the presence of Ga Yu and Ju Jung to protect me, I must watch my safety in case of an attack. So they arranged everything. Please don't get so upset. Your Highness, who would dare to offend you or try to attack you? Oh, also, there are two generals here who would dare move. They haven't caught the assassins yet for the last time, but I'm sure that we'll get them. Any assassin has to be stupid to try me out again. I'm well protected now. Oh, please. Oh, she is waiting for your order. Well, call her then. Yes. Call Lady Yan. Call Lady Yan! Call Lady Yan! Your Royal Highness and Madam. Get up. Thank you. Good. Hmm. Very beautiful. Jayu is still very upset he lost you. <laughs> I am not worthy of your compliments. Madam is the real beauty. <laughs> I hear your skill can find no opponent. But Yansi is also very skilled on the loot. So let's see who will be the winner in our competition. I know only little. 
I dare not compete with madam. Please correct me. Uh, mm -hmm. <laughs> Wait a minute. I want you to change seats over there. Begin. Give it a richness I've never heard before. What a heavenly sound they produce. I find it hard to keep up with it. Each one play a solo now, all right? Let us enjoy the lovely music. What do you say? <laughs> the song should be played in the court. I dare not listen to it. I must go and change clothes now. Eh? No need! Highness, his clothes are all wet, can't you see? Please let him go and change. Uh. Hmm. <laughs> right, but be quick about it. Yancy has composed a few songs. I want your opinion on them. Please excuse me, sir. <laughs> How are things? Wait until next time. It has to be then. Yes. It's also our last chance. I'll handle it. I must be away.
Try the fish. I don't care about the fish. Get out of here! Trying to kill me all by himself. <laughs> Turn him over. I want to have a look at him. Yes, sir. <laughs> <laughs> 
Like we've done it. Yeah, don't die just yet. Yeah. I I want to die with you. Yeah. Sure. Can you play the lute again? I want to hear it for one last time. Yes. I've only played it for you. Oh, my dearest. Mommy! Ma! Hey. Our son. 